Welcome back, guys, to Neo: The World Ends With You. Our last episode, we reached Tipsy Toes Hall and learned the riddles we had to investigate, stemming from videos posted by an occult expert, Macastry. We started to get to the bottom of the seven targets, with a shoplifting player leading to rumors of ghostly disappearances and a step on Spain Hill giving people the creeps of a scorpion noise stinging those who tripped on it for our first two. Now we continue to solve the other five. You know, I kind of thought Urban Legends would be a little more, you know, legendary. For real, that ain't no mystery, yo. The only mystery I is how you managed to solve any of them. Huh? Whoa! Hey, loser. So, what were your pinheads talking to that other Reaper about? What Reaper? The one with the pink hair. Duh. Ah, you refer to Lady Izuki. Right, right. So, were you chatting about the game or something? Mm -hmm. Well, kind of, yeah. Turns out we might not be dead after all, which is actually a bad thing in this case. Uh huh. Ah, Mama. Hey, kitty girl. You're with the Shinjuku gang, right? Yeah, and? Only the Shinjuku Reapers is messed up enough to drag living people into UG, yo. So, what's it to you? Just want to know what your angle is. What do you all get out of doing this? Oh. Hell, if I know, and even if I did, why would I bother telling you bozos? A Reaper. Listen, Reaper. It's Shoka. As far as the RNG is concerned, we don't exist right now. Can that ever be fixed? Um. Not if you don't win. So why don't you stop moaning and get on with the mission? You see now the room Brian's been cleaning up every week. Your point? How come you all just don't just go ahead and make them Reapers already? Ain't no point having them play the game forever and ever. It's their choice. They say they want to keep playing, so we let them. Then I've got another question for you. How come you Reapers is doing nothing when it's called the Reapers game, yo? Them room bringers is acting more like Reapers than any of you all. Uh, pretty bold statement coming from a Reaper reject. <laughs> you think you know so much about our job because you played some prehistoric version of the game. The only people who matter around here are the people with power. Our weaklings can whine all they want, but nobody's gonna listen. Well then, why don't they quit whining and start acting? Because I just... I can't! That's just how Shiba... I mean, that's just how we do things in Shinjuku. As long as you got power, then the game is yours. Take no prisoners, leave no survivors. That's the Shinjuku way. That's brutal. Maybe, but if you really want to get ahead, then you got to do whatever it takes. What kind of whatever? I'm talking trickery, deceit, lies, backstabbing. Whatever it takes. <laughs> the dirtier you play, the more fun it is to watch. So I hereby grant you permission to put on one hell of a show. <sighs> You're on to the core, yo. Less a goddess of death and more an agent of disorder. Oh, you're too kind. Now go out there and prove how wicked you really are, will ya? It's about time someone shook things up around here. This is dummy. Later, losers. Well, if she really wants us to shake things up, then taking on the room bringers would be a good start. I say we accept Canon's offer. You would say that. What do you think about taking on the Reapers? That proposition could place us in great peril. Hey, B, Nagi, what do you two think about teaming up with Kanon? Hey, a bad idea. I just don't know much about a lady. If you're thinking we can trust her, then I'm all in, yo. Uh. And although Lady Kanon's display of chivalry may be, it is difficult to discern the authenticity of her intentions. Yeah, that's what I thought. There's still so many unknowns. I don't know what... Oh, great. It's everyone's favorite game master. Greetings, Sheeple of Shibuya. This is your Game Master Shiba speaking. Hope you're still hungering for more on day number four. <laughs> Got some red hot news for you. Ain't this guy ever mixed things up? I cannot recall hearing any other variations. <sighs> the target is still on the loose, completely unsighted. It's as if all of Shibuya has gone cold. Don't tell me you've all started hibernating. Here's hoping it's just the quiet before the firestorm. If not, then I don't see much of a future for the city. I guess this guy's a Shinjuku Reaper too. Hmm. So awaken from your wintry slumber, players, lest the room bring us win again. It's time to burn the candles of your imaginations at both ends and show me what you're really made of. I don't trust this punk. What's the real point in this game, yo? Hmm. With that, I bid you adieu. I see. Shall we proceed with the mission then? Shall we ever? Assuming you were talking to me, that is. Uh, You'd learn well. Perhaps a little too well. 
Rock, 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 king. Let's buy some stuff for Natural Puppy. Hello there. Oh, well, I actually can't sell all at the moment. I want to buy stuff in Natural Puppy because, of course, our VFD level is still below three. So let's get Rindo HP boost. Sold it. And we're money. <laughs> that went well. Thank you. Do come again. I need Gotta money. Focus. I kind of stat. Kind of stats. That's different. Should I just put on my super pin again and go to work? Get some quick cash, maybe? Sorry, but you're no match for me. Otherwise, we'll never get VIP level through them. Tread carefully. Not quite sure how I ended up switching targets then, but oh. Would you let him go, pretty please? Bombs away. Take a Anyway, you're a target, really. Nice position you've got there. Leave me alone. I just want the money. Victory is all but assured. Let's turn up the volume, yo! Yeah. Yeah. Any a poison frog by look of it? Take you out with that. Sucker! My poison prop chance is sadly not as good as I would hope. That try is pretty good though. At least if we've got several frogs on, we get pin for everyone. So there's enough money for us. So I have the stuff. Bombs away! Question is, can I hit the right target here? There we go. Uh, is she okay? Sucker. Oh yeah. Looking good, brother. Yeah. Let's end this. Drop the flame. Yeah. Not bad, I'd say. An endless field of fire. Could have been worse, you feel? 441. Oh, you, the world within. Well, that was worth in a different way. Mum's secret ingredient is evolving to a mysterious gift. And we've mastered that one. And we've got a new R1 as well. So this is now 644, that's way better. And it's a much bigger bomb by the look of it. Meanwhile, Laser Inferno is maxed out and we didn't get anything better, so what do I go through next? I think I might go for Tasty Ovine Snack here. Where's this new pin I just got then, the mirror pin? I can't see it there, that's for sure. Uh oh. 
I switched and I didn't want to. The Ever Arctic Treasure? Oh, we got Icy Winds ones as well. Well, I'll take that instead. A little bit of ice works quite well, I feel. That was good finding that one out. So this is a grenade launcher. It's a different kind of bomb. It's a light bomb. So let's do the world within and then switch to the light bomb afterwards. Ah, oh, quite pleased about getting that one. Seems not that bad, does it? I did not make much money. Still not? Come on. There we go, VRP level 3. Just about. Thank you, do come again. And enough to buy some food as well. Alright, so our next one is not Cat Street, but next to. Let's move, let's have a look. That's some blue noise. All your asses is grass. Just be careful. Is it the shark I take it then? Bombs away! Keep it up, B! I got you! Let's keep it up! Indeed! That seems to work quite well, doesn't it? Booyah! Booyah! It's over! Well, I guess they wouldn't be weak to that, would they? Bombs away! These bombs are going in somewhat heavy, though. So far, so good. Let's keep it going. You're done for. Wow. And that's the whole group. Nothing less. Belange Lapin. That's new. Another R1. Now, will I remember that it's new? That's the question itself. Cat Street. Our next riddle. Ain't that supposed to be a legend around here, yo? Yep. I think so. Want me to work my magic? Uh. By all means. Time to focus on Macastry's urban legends. Gotta focus. Let's get down to business. Alright, so we wanna go bottom right on the left stick. Uh, the problem is it's getting Come on, think! Moving away from the one you wanna hit otherwise. I need food actually. Let's move. Waste of a trip. Wasn't the telephone pole from Maca Street's urban legend over here on Cat Street? Said you were supposed to be able to hear the voices of the dead if you get close enough? Hey. I guess the telephone pole is that one over by Jupes. Probably. Now we just need to get a little closer and see if we hear anything. Mm. Listening to the wells of the dead was not on my to-do do list today. Let's hurry up and check it out, yo. You volunteered to listen for us, Beep. Uh. Oh, show my hero. Hello. This telephone pole, though. This is a spot, right? I can't hear a damn thing. <laughs> Kudos to you for just going to check it out, though. No fear. Anyway, maybe it takes a little while to get going. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Let's wait and see if anything changes. Oh, that's weird. I see. I could not agree more. What do you mean? Did you see that lady who just walked by, Pete? They looked spooked. What you say? Seriously, so the legend was legit after all. Let's give him a scan and find out why. Let's have a look. How was that person groaning just now, right? Suddenly they were hurt. Pretty sure it came from somewhere in front of me, but where? Oh, that lady got so scared she practically scared me half to death. Total scareception. Looks like something just spooked that lady over there real good. Maybe I'll go check it out for myself. Time to kill, yes. Let's move. Loads of people. I will say, I love this area. You'd never know you're still in Shibuya. So much quieter over here than it is by the station. It's the walking ramps. This place is way too quiet for a street that connects Shibuya and Harajuku. All this silence makes me want to go clubbing and make some noise. Have more people to check out? Oh, I'm pretty sure some weirdo behind me was just moaning to himself. Why am I such a creep magnet? 
Wait, this is leading into an interesting trail. I just want I just heard someone groaning to my left, but there's no one there. Sure seems like they heard something. Uh, Doubtless the souls are d d damned. But how come only some people can hear it? No idea, that's part still a mystery. Mm. You think some people just have a sixth sense for that stuff? Let's ascertain what all those who can hear the voices have in common. Don't tell me you can't hear my voice now. Some of them ain't even standing here though. Uh. Wait a second. The people who did hear the voices are standing in a straight line. What? Uh, I guess so, but what's it mean? Perhaps we will find out if we follow the people's path. What our answer could lie along the line they created. Alright, let's head down the street. May we find the truth we desire. Yeah, this way, yeah? Doesn't look like there's anyone past here who heard the voices. Alright, let's have a look around here then. To that side on my speakers. <gasps> Whoa! Oh my! Huh? Damn, you guys scared me. What's up? What? What do you mean? Didn't you hear that? Uh, no. How about you, beat? I ain't hear nothing, yo. What? Well, I certainly did. It was from my right. It was the most disturbing groan. No kidding. You think I'll hear it too if I stand over there? It's that way, Gabriel. <laughs> The hell was that? Yeah. So you can only hear it if you're standing right here. The mystery deepens. Hey, I think I found it. That appears to be a speaker. So what? It was just some dumb prank. That's from all around. Uh -huh. Oh dear, I can hear it again. Wait, it just stopped. Uh, boss? It appears one must stand between the speaker and the telephone pole to hear the sound. No way, you're right. What? This is getting whack about a minute, yo. Let's look it up. Let's see, speaker direction. Ah, this must be it. Apparently it's called a directional speaker. What's it do? It lets you project sound in a specific direction. And if you don't stand in the right spot, you won't be able to hear anything. I see. That certainly matches what we've experienced today. Yep, why is it here to begin with? <sighs> it's a bogus prank. Yo, look, there's a camera right there. You think someone's streaming footage of people freaking out? Oh, what a creep. But succinctly, Sam reprobate's idea of a joke transformed into an urban legend. Guess they wanted to get famous by starting something supernatural. The show. All that matters is we know what's up now. Let's go tell our Reaper. Great minds. And a man tight obtained. Hey! Hold on there, Signor Rindo. My toy! <laughs> I see running into Vu here. By which I mean you. Sorry, cosmopolitan habits die hard. Yeah, sure. So anyway, today's mission is a little doozy, huh? All this spooky supernatural stuff kind of gives me the creeps. Uh... No kidding. I would have thought it was right up your alley. Uh, well... I might be more at ease if I could see behind the curtains, so to speak. Another new face, huh? Meet Lord Matoy, the leader of the Pure Hurts. Pure Hurts? Yeah. So you ain't with us then. Oh, uh... Sacre bleu. You must be the infamous Mr. Daisukeno. What you say? Cut it. I'll go by Beat, yo. Oh, me scusi, my dear Beat. They say you are très bien informed. Uh, I mean, Moikoto, about how the Reapers operate. Huh? My cult. What you say? Uh, looks like it's Spanish for knowledgeable. Then just say that, yo. Oh, oh my sincerest apologies. Good for you, though, Rindo. Canon and I would kill to have a player like B on our side. Uh, is that so? Of course. There's only a few teams left, so we need all the help we can get if we want to avoid rage uh, rage. Yeah, I know that feeling. Hmm. What a predicament. We are truly les miserables. It's times like these that people usually go for a... Oh, what's it called? Use your words. Ah, uh, yes, an uh, alianza. I'm sure that would put us all at ease. I'd be more at ease if I knew what that was. Mm -hmm. Italian for alliance, apparently. What exactly do you mean by that, anyway? Ah, forgive me, I didn't intend to present it as an outright proposal. Well, it wouldn't be the first we've heard. Oh, has someone else already approached you? Uh, you see, uh... I struggle to imagine those thugs in first place asking for assistance. <laughs> which only leaves Canon, n'est-ce pas? Maybe we should just tell him. No, that's an awful idea. Hey, no need to fret at all. Fret et al. I had a suspicion Kenon might be plotting something like this again. Huh? Again? 
She wants you to help her bring ruin to the ruin bringers. Is for that? I thought she might have given up after her first few failed attempts. But I guess she changed her tune after witnessing your true potenza. Wait, when did she fail before? Well, let's see, there was that fight against the steady Suzukichi and then about with the silent but deadly Sugumi. But you lot managed to shut them down. Sin problema. Or both them. I mean feet, let me tell you. Fascinating. So I call my friend them. So the ruin bringer's leader is remaining hidden until their underlings have been bested. Wow, Kenon must really believe in us. I don't envy your position, mi amigo. You're faced with a tough decision. Hmm. But allow me to share my thoughts. Forming an alianza under current circumstances would be muy bien. So you think it's a good idea? It certainly isn't a bad one. I'm prepared to do what I must as well. Uh, and what's that? Why well, help out, of course. The more people working together, the better the result at. French for a result. Hey. The verite of the matter is, I don't want to get a raise, and if possible, I don't want anyone else to get a raise either. I'm right there with you, Matoy. It's as I once wrote. Existing means being here or wherever you may be being. I think it's vital we don't lose sight of the undeniable fact that all of us exist here right now together. Yeah, I think I get what you mean. Like, we're here for a reason. I dig it too, yo. Even if you ain't here now, you was before, and that still matters. But well, it's certainly nice to be entendido by you gents. I am eternally grateful to the city that brought us together and to all those who call her home. Let's give it our all, eh, amigo? Ta -ta. Drop me a line whenever you feel like it. Until then, au revoir. God, you're so irritating. How much of that did I say wrong? Man, I feel bad for all, you know? Stuck in last place and everything. All right. If the room brings are on top and we're right behind them, and that leaves either Motoy or Cannon's team in the bottom. Yes. They do anything to get out of it too, right? Gotta focus. What's going on Let's here? Have a look. Ah, it's okay. It's just the thing again. Let's move. I need to get some food in me. The question is where I haven't been for food yet. Or enough. Hey there. Maybe I haven't been to veggie lovers enough. I do wonder. They're low on the calories. <laughs> what could I get for you? We're not really getting speed up. I think I'm gonna go with HP and defense. A veggie super special. Man, I am starving. Not big on the calories. Really Alright, taking the plus five star though. Keep eating healthy. Let's move. <laughs> it's like that voice is so recognizable, isn't it? So we need to find out where we're going next. <gasps> it's gonna be the Digimon Scramble Crossing thing, coming from all directions at once. Pretty sure this area's got a legend of its own. For me, it's proud the interwebs. Uh, even the sites with nearly any traffic have been erased. Don't you wonder how the other teams are tackling this mission? Mm. You can say that again. Who cares about other teams, yo? We got our own strengths. Let's use them. Go on, Fret. You're up. Huh? Uh, oh, okay. Sit back, relax, and leave it to me. Here goes nothing. If it is that, that'd be great. Gotta focus. So what are we thinking? We've already done this once before, if it is. In another game. Uh four cardinal directions. Our goal is over here. Gonna buoy it till I drop. Probably not then. That's the Jumbotron Makasri mentioned, right? The one that shows some... Well, hey, you can't go forward. Shows some place for a split second and even if you go there... And if you go there, you die in seven days' time. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Wow, it shows the UG. Wait, what do you have to do there to die again? I think he said you have to walk around counterclockwise one time. Like, who would even do that? Okay. Walking around the counterclockwise. Why do I want to want to die? 
counterclockwise. Is that enough? I'm walking too. That didn't work. Let's have a look. There must be Let's more people. Move. Yep. Nope, I ended up in battle. Get in my way and get shredded, yo. No sweat for Fred. There's more layers to this one. Power penguins! What's your say for? for? Oh no! Boom! Kaboom! Over already, yo! Big of bada boom! Squirt big on that one! We really need some God, more focus. shooty ones, that's for sure. Type purse strings. Man, when is that place going to show on the big screen? Max Street said some place in Shibuya appears on the Jumbotron for one second every day. I guess Urban Legends is just that. Legends, who cares if some place in Shibuya gets shown once a day anyway? So we've got to find the place that flashes on the Jumbotron. The place where once one walks around to counterclockwise, one dies seven days later. Or so they say. Even if that was true, who the heck would actually try it? I fear you are directing your question at the wrong person. <sighs> the place only shows up on screen for a second, right? Really not feeling just staring at the TV forever waiting to see it. Maybe there's some way we could find out roughly when it gets shown. Mm. I could try using my psych in front of the Jumbotron. Sounds like a plan. Have you think it'll work, yo? It will, as long as I get the right idea. Alrighty, time to focus on that big screen. So like here. Let's have a look. Let's get down to business. Uh, uh. Big screen. Come on, think. More people. What's the deal with that place that just flashed on the jumpatron for a sec? The look at building covered in plants. Screen must be on the fritz. Oh, I swear I just saw something on the big screen. Looked like a building with an arch. Let's move. You want me to go counterclockwise around there? Got any more people to speak to here? It's a building with an arch. Oh, there's a guy. Man, I know I've seen that place that just showed up on the big screen. It's sandwiched between two streets. Somewhere around here. That's like there's plants growing on the walls of this place. And it has an arch. And what's that about being between two roads? Mm -hmm. Not sure, but we know it's definitely somewhere in Shibuya. If anyone thinks they know where it might be, let me know, okay? Tower Records. It's Modi. Let's move. Well, there's plants on the wall here, uh. and several arches. It is in between two roads too, yo. Ah, uh, the building on the big screen must have been M Modi. M.O.D., I was about to say. Ministry of Defense. Mm-hmm. Nice work, team. Anyway, what were we supposed to do once we got here again? One must walk in a single counterclockwise circle. Ah, uh, right. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, won't that kill me? Well, we ain't gonna know if nobody gives it a shot. It's cool. I'll do it. Huh? I mean, if you really wanna. Too late to stop him now. He's already halfway round. It does not seem to have any apparent effect. Imagine if we had to actually wait the full seven days. Hold it. Hey, Twisterinos. I've been watching you kids for a while now. So exactly what kind of business have you got with me? Let me guess. Trying to rack up points. Huh? Wait. What have points got to do with anything? <sighs> I mean, if you're not interested, then I'll be on my way. Could you at least tell us what you're talking about? We're only here because we need to look in some urban legends. Such as? Well, they say if one walks around this area counterclockwise, one perishes within a week. We've got to get to the bottom of this stuff to get past one of your pals. 
So hurry up and tell us if you know something, yo. And enough of you, actually, punk. Time for you to face the noise. No! Is this what it is? This guy just gets annoyed by people? Let's do it to it, yo. So then he kills them? Ow. It's taken out with the greatest of speed, wasn't it? Bombs away. The penguins are not gonna like this stuff at all. Don't know why I decided to salute them. Farewell, penguins. The bomb is coming. It's an honor to be recognized. Bangs of ice. More level ups. Damn it all. So you feel like talking now? How about you start by telling us what you were doing here? Huh. What you say? Don't make me kick you while you're down. Okay, I was just using the jumbotron to advertise my location. And if they walked clock counterclockwise around that pillar, I know I knew they wanted to do business. Okay. My well, terms are simple. She would pay me three hundred thousand yen for one round with a noise. Huh? You mean you're providing players with? Yeah. You got it. Points. For all the sloths who take a day off here and there. This is just my way of helping them keep up with the rat race. Get their heads in the game again, if you will. Still, 300,000 seems kind of steep for one noise. <laughs> hey, the market dictates the price, not me. I see. Something tells me these transactions are far from kosher. Take a chill pill, Specs. The rankings aren't going to change because someone took out an extra noise or two. As if it's not providers for players who don't want their team leaders to know they've been slacking. Well, which teams are we talking here? Cannons? My toys? <sighs> All I can say is there are a few players who aren't exactly playing. But they know they'd be in hot war if their leaders found out. That's one way of putting it. And that's where I come in. But what's any of this got to do with the RG? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Oh, those punks with the sixth sense. Uh, yeah, a few people from the RG picked up on my subliminal messaging. But they were getting in the way, so I sent them packing. So that's how this whole legend came to be. Seriously, yo? You're a joke, yo. Mm -hmm. I feel we may have to rework the truth when we report our findings this time. Probably a good idea if you don't want to earn the wrath of your rivals. Now they'd be kind, will take kindly to being out as cheats. Anyway, peace. <sighs> but you can think about what to tell the Reaper on the way. Most important thing is that we know the truth now. Let's head on over to Center Street and give him our report. I'm guessing I'd probably get, like five might be a hundred points, twenty points each. Let me think this through. Seems about right to me. Hmm. 